And we're back. We are here with Robin from Detroit. So, um, Robin, what is it? What is it like to be gay? Who told you that? Did someone tell you that? Who told you that? How did, How do you know? Um, I just, I just lucky guess. Oh well, I guess I can tell you. Um, that's really sweet. I mean, I've been really, I've been dating this guy Robert. How, how was your relationship with Robert? Uh, I mean, it's like this whole Bert and Ernie thing, like. We live in the same house, and we live in this basement of the Sesame Street thing, and it's just this great. Can't even describe how awesome it is right now. Like when I come home from like my day at the dance studio, and I really can find peace with Robert as a person. You know, he's like, have you ever had someone? You have such nice earphones again. Uh, have you ever had someone that you can just be open with? Like, um, you can just let out your feelings. Yes. I mean, even to the point, like, Bert and Ernie, like, you can take baths together. Um, I don't think I've gone that far. With anybody? Um. You should really try it. You really need to pursue it. Um, yeah, so. Make you feel really great about what, what are those things on your hands? Okay, well, I didn't want to tell anybody today, but I am starting out a new fashion called Sock Puppets. So when you're out with all your friends, you can be like, hey. And they always know it's you, because I mean, who else wears these things? I mean, it's just me, so you can be like, hey, how you doing? So, um, what, what, are you, what are you doing for um, Christmas? Um, I don't know, I have to say. I think I'm going to Robert's house with this family. What about you? What are you doing? Um, are you doing anything I'm, different? I'm spending I'm all, it. I'm all about different. So, um, when did you first realize you were gay? When, when did you know? You know, I, I like to think of myself as like coming out of the womb. It was this big finale for me. Like, you know, most people come out of the closet, but I just like burst it out through the placenta. And I was, I was just me, you know, like my, the, my makeup and everything. It was just this beautiful, this awesome, really this just awesome moment for me and my family and just really everybody that supports me on Facebook. and. You know, I Twitter about it all the time, about my, my movement, and I think it's really, I think, what do you think of, like, this new, like, uh, don't ask, don't tell thing, what do you think of that? Um, I have, uh, I don't disagree with it at all. You don't disagree? That's, that's what you're talking about. Um. You don't, you, do you mean you, do you support me, or you don't support me? Yeah, I support you. Okay, because, I, I, you know, I was on a show last week, and I had to, like, I was talking to this straight guy, you know, that, um, what's that guy's name, the director, that, um. That's the movies for the Jews, that he hates the Jews. Mel Gibson? Yes, Mel Gibson. And, you know, Mel Gibson has something against all people. Mel Gibson is just terrible. And I was talking to Chris Hilton about it, ironically, the other day. And, you know, I, th I just, I think Mel Gibson's gay. I think he's just like this gay Jewish guy. Because, I mean, he obviously just can't let his feelings out. Hey, you want to treat him? But, um, yeah, uh, what, what, what was I talking about? <laughs> Um, what do you think of Mel Gibson? I just think Mel Gibson is a really bad influence on children because, I mean, you see him in the news like every other day, and Mel Gibson is just out there, and he's, you know, he's, I think he'd be a really great movie. He'd be very good for our um, We're going to march on wa Washington next week. Come? Uh, sure. I'll, I'll be there. Oh, really? We'll look for you in the crowd. Um, I'm sure so you'll be hard to miss with your nice hair. What does your, what do your parents think of... Well, actually, um, my dad came out of the closet last week. And eight months earlier, my mom did. So right now we're having like this great thing because they both, you know, they bring people over. And, you know, it, people really need to realize that it's just about making yourself happy, not anybody else. It's it's your life. You should just go out and get it. You just have to live your life, you know. So um, what are you into right now? Well, I'm, I'm into anything different, really. Um, I, I'm really all about different. I mean, I can do anything different. Like, I like um, horseback riding. That's always been a big thing of mine. I like uh, unicycling with, you know, juggling at the same time. I've been trying that as something new. I have been, oh, what else? I took a trip to Iraq. Saw a lot of cool people there. It was a little scary, but I saw some people that I knew. Farouk, and I'm not remembering his name. It started with an A, but, uh, yeah, they were all very friendly. And, you know, me and Robert are going on our eighth anniversary to like this, this weird island in the middle of nowhere and it's just gonna be this really great time because we're gonna like bond and really get to know each other and we're, we're gonna get to know ourselves as we get to learn each other um 
Have you ever had someone like that? You can just let everything out. Uh, sure. Uh, Is it your mother? You seem like someone whose mother that would be. I like her hair. Did you get your hair from your mother? Uh, no. no. Um, so we'll be right back with uh, something else. Why? Do you want me to get on?